If you're ready to upgrade the sound system by adding an app or apps to your vehicle, you're gonna wanna stick around for this video. We'll be taking a look at Memphis Car Audio's PRX series amps. They come in various channels and wattage. There are three monoblock amplifiers, a two channel, a four channel, and a five channel amplifier, ranging from 300 watts all the way up to 1500 watts. So hang with us as we break these amps down individually. Now Memphis Car Audio is based out of Memphis, Tennessee and has been in the car audio game for several decades. Now we at Breakers have been carrying these products for over 15 years and Memphis has progressively improved on products year after year. With products like the VIV amps, components and subwoofers and of course the Mojo line. These PRX amplifiers are midline product but produce lots of power and sound excellent. These amps are extremely popular both in our store and online and we've had tremendous success in building systems around these amplifiers for our customers in our brick and mortar stores. Another thing to note, these amplifiers are extremely reliable and the failure rate is close to zero. But before we dive deeper into these amps, let's take a look at some of the common design elements throughout the line. First off, these have a nice rounded edge design opposed to just a squared off 90 degree edge, giving them a more modern look. The heatsink is on the top of the amp and the connections are on the bottom, instead of them being on the side, making the installation cleaner. The wiring connections use Allen head screws and the necessary Allen head wrenches come with each amplifier. There is a nice blue LED accent that runs across the face of the amp and the Memphis badge comes unaffixed giving you the option to mount the amp in either direction. All the crossover and gain settings are located underneath the magnetic panel for a cleaner look. Aesthetically these are great looking amplifiers and Memphis has done a great job in the design element. Another thing to note is that all these amplifiers come with a wired base knob and signal sensing turn on useful if you're using the stock head unit. Okay, so let's break these down even further and let's take a closer look at what these amplifiers have to offer and in which application is best suited for each app. That way you can see which app is best for you. Okay, so the first amplifier is the PRX-A300.2, 300 watts total, 100 watts times two at four ohms and 150 watts times two at two ohms. And if bridged mono into four ohms, this amp will produce 300 watts. Now the use of this amp calls for a very specific application. There are not a lot of situations in which this amplifier would be suitable, but they would include tower speakers on a boat, a car with only front stage, or a setup where the fade is not an issue, or if you have a set of two old 8 ohm speakers and you need a two channel bridgeable amplifier. But if you have an application like this, then consider this amplifier. Currently $259. Now unfortunately we don't have this unit in stock because we don't sell too many of them. So we can't take a closer look, but the next one we do. So let's move to that one. Now in the lineup is Memphis's only four channel amplifier and one of our favorite four channel amplifiers in this category because of its sound quality and clarity. Now the reason why is this is an AB class amp, which produces better sound quality than its counterpart D class amplifiers, but it's definitely larger. So in the box you get a certificate that shows you how much power the amp actually produces and if it passed certain tests before it's sent out. Now this particular amplifier produces 328 watts and that's all channels driven into 4 ohms at 14.4 volts. So at 4 ohms this amplifier produces 50 watts times 4 and if you're running 2 ohm speakers 75 watts times 4. It has high pass and low pass filters both on front and rear. Variable high pass between 80 hertz and 1000 hertz at a 12 dB octave. Variable low pass filters between 50 and 250 hertz also at a 12 dB octave. Now there's a variable bass boost at 0 to 12 dB at 45 hertz and that's what that bass knob controls as well. And this amplifier has a wide frequency response from 20 hertz all the way up to 20,000 hertz. 8 gauge power and ground leads with a 60 amp fuse recommended. This app is perfect for running mids and highs and handle about 50 watts if they're 4 ohm and 75 watts if they're 2 ohm. If you're running just mids and highs off this app, match it up with a pair of Memphis PRX components in the front and coaxials in the rear. Available in a wide range of sizes. If you're using this amplifier to run your full system, then pair up the same speakers, put them on the front stage on channels 1 and 2, and then run the rear off the radio and wire a single PRX sub bridge to channels 3 and 4. That will put that in 3 channel mode. Now remember this does come with a bass knob so you do have control over the subs while driving around. Overall a good solid clean amplifier priced at $339. Next to PRX-A 700.5 which is a 5 channel amplifier 700 watt. Okay so certified power on this amplifier is 725 watts. That's all channels driven, 4 ohm for the front channels and the rear channels, and 2 ohm for the sub. Now the most common way to run this amplifier is 50 watts times 4 into 4 ohms for your interior speakers. But if you have 2 ohm speakers, this amplifier will produce 75 watts times 4. And for your sub channel, you're going to want to load this down to 2 ohms to get that full 500 watts. Variable high pass crossover between 80 hertz 
and 1000 Hz 12 dB octave on the front and rear channels. Variable low pass filter between 50 Hz and 250 Hz 12 dB octave on all channels. Variable bass boost between 0 and 12 dB at 45 Hz. And a subsonic filter for the subwoofer of course between 20 and 50 Hz at a 12 dB octave. So match this amplifier up with the PRX components for the front and coaxials in the rear and the sub you can do a set of PRX 10s or 12s in a ported box or if you don't want to take up as much room a single Memphis MB 10 or 12 in either a ported or sealed box. Now this setup is ideal for any type of vehicle, whether it's a coupe, sedan, or a truck. You'll get good overall sound quality with enough bass to enjoy it from the inside of the vehicle, opposed to being heard a block away. Four gauge power and ground leads with a 150 amp fuse recommended. So this app is priced at $529. Now that does it for the multi-channel amplifiers, now on to the monobox. Okay, starting with the PRX-A601. Now this is a one ohm stable amp and will produce 600 watts times one when loaded down to that impedance. And according to the certificate, this amplifier tested at 650 watts. Low pass filter between 50 and 180 hertz at a 12 dB octave. Variable bass boost between zero and 12 dB at 45 hertz. Variable subsonic filter between 20 and 50 Hz at a 12 dB octave. 8 gauge recommended power and ground leads with a 60 amp fuse. Now match these up with a pair of power reference 10s or 12s in either a sealed or vented enclosure. If you want a single sub, then run the Memphis MB series. And we have even run this amplifier with a pair of the MBs in a ported enclosure and this amp actually pushes them well. Okay, next, the PRXA 1001, one of Memphis's most popular amplifier and produces 1000 watts RMS times one into one ohm. And the certificate on this amplifier says it produces 1050 watts. Okay, same crossover settings, variable low pass filter between 50 and 180 Hertz at a 12 dB octave, variable bass boost between zero and 12 dB at 45 Hertz, variable subsonic filter between 20 and 50 Hertz at a 12 dB octave. Of course, this is a D-class amplifier, four gauge power and ground lead with a 150 amp fuse recommended. So match this amplifier with a set of any woofers rated at 500 watts each, including the Memphis MB subs or a single subwoofer that can handle up to 1000 watts, like the Memphis M7 10 or 12. This is a solid 1000 watt amplifier that delivers deep, hard hitting bass with good sound quality. One of our most popular amps in the 1000 watt category. Pair this up with the Memphis PRX A300.4 and you'll have a great combination. Now the Memphis PRX 1001 is priced at $449. Next onto the largest amplifier in this lineup, this is the PRX A1500.1. Like all the mono black apps in this lineup, this is one ohm stable. 1000 watts times one into two ohms and 1500 watts times one into one ohm. And according to the certificate, this amplifier puts out 1530 watts. Again, variable low pass filter between 50 and 180 Hertz, 12 dB octave, variable bass boost between zero and 12 dB at 45 Hertz, a variable subsonic filter between 20 and 50 Hertz at a 12 dB octave, D-class amplifier technology, zero gauge pound ground input, and 150 amp fuse recommended. This amplifier produces heavy duty bass for all you bass heads out there that need it loud. Excellent sound quality for any type of music, whether it's hip hop to rock, this app will deliver. Now this amplifier is only $100 more than the 1000, priced at $549. So that wraps up this line of amplifiers. And if you're interested in any of these amps, there are links in the description below taking you directly to each product page. Free shipping to the continental US and a one year warranty. We also offer financing. We are the car stereo and performance shop where you can charge it so you can get what you want today and make low, easy monthly payments. Just go to our website, add to the cart, and choose one of our financing plans when checking out. So if you like this video or found it useful in any way, make sure you hit that like button. Also subscribe to our channel. We are consistently putting out videos like this so you do not want to miss out. Check out our Instagram page. That's breakers.stereo and performance. Again, my name is Josh. I'm from Breaker Stereo and Performance. Thanks for watching. Peace.